Okay, latest contraption for August 2012, four arms. Here we go. They bend up shoulder, the elbow, hands move, drop down left right, thumbs move. I've built two motion capture arms that, for example, when I bend my elbow, it pulls a wire inside the plastic tubing. There are four other wires on that strap on my hand there, so if I go left, right, up or down, and one strap on the thumb. In the future, I plan to have all four fingers moving. Now you see how the same plastic tube and the same wire comes out the robot arm. Well, I should call it puppetry, not robotics, because it's just done with wires. Let's see, the elbow, can you see that? Again, a wire, a simple mechanical hinge. Look over here, I built this so that the forearm could twist. You see the round cylinder inside the square tube, but Whenever I tried to make it so that a rotation of my forearm causes this forearm to turn, just the forces were too high for such a small radius that it goes around. You can see how on the shoulder here, I've got a nice large radius that the wire pulls. So that makes it much easier. Same deal with the other side. So with a nice large shoulder. That makes it a, a lot less force I need to provide to do the pulling. And so I'm just going to have four wires for the four fingers. And you see this contraption here I've got so that as I pull the wire the thumb will close. I'm going to do kind of a Hindu belly dancer kind of costume. So I'll have symbols and the thumb can snap the symbols that'll be on the forefinger and thumb. So I want to be able to do a little bit of music with it. So that's how far I've gotten. So a little bit of manipulation that I can do between the two of them. Alright, next step, we get the costume and of course going to cover up the metal structure with uh, not exactly rubber skin, but some plastic tubing that'll cover it. Maybe I'll be able to paint it beige, and I'll let you know what I come up with. So, peace. Literally.